what's up YouTube all right so I'm here with my student um, he's been looking for an appointment for about two months right mm -hmm. so he finally found an appointment so we're practicing so he think he could take his driving test tomorrow all right so I'm gonna run through the actual driving test at a location in Broward County I'm not gonna say what location it is because I don't want to get into problems with the DMV so we're gonna run through it but before I get into the video I'm gonna ask you to do what I always ask you to do like the video share the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't already hit that notification bell so you will be notified when I post my next video and keep in mind that I'm making these videos to help you know I'm making the video because I get really good feedback from the people that, that the videos are quite helpful to them and that feels good you know what I mean so it's 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 not like I'm charging money for these videos I'm making the videos and and it feels good knowing that I'm helping that said let's get into the video all right so like I said we're at a location he's gonna be running through the test so he can get get his license tomorrow and if you've been watching the channel you know that my students all get their license right dude mm -hmm. yeah all right so straighten the wheel make sure the wheel's straight right there no no all right go out turn all the way around mm -hmm. so you can know that it's straight all the way turn the wheel all the way and do what i just showed you mm -hmm. all the way left and then straighten it one all the way around again two so you know it's straight there all right so now we're going to reverse from here they're going to ask you, before we do all that, they're going to ask you, if you're parked facing uphill, what direction do you turn the steering wheel? You turn to the left. What else do you do? Yeah, you put it in park and then you turn on the ignition. Turn off the ignition. You turn off the ignition. Put it in park, pull up your parking brake, and then turn off the ignition. Mm -hmm. That's what they're going to tell you. They're going to ask you to do the turn signal. Signal left, signal right, blow the horn, and press the brake. Again, they're going to make sure all of the lights on the car is actually working, the horn's working. It's called a safety check. Alright, so now we're going to reverse and we're going to run through the actual test. Alright, so go straight back and you're going to reverse until your mirror gets to the end of these lines. Okay, like that looks good. Now you're going that way, you're going to the left, so you're going to turn the wheel all the way right. All the way until it stops, and look behind you as you do that. Look over your left shoulder, because that way they can see. You can literally see out there, you know. Back up when your mirror gets to the middle, like about there, you stop. Again, you're trying to avoid the cars behind you, and you're trying to go forward without hitting the cars okay. in front of you. So now you're going to turn left, turn the wheel all the way left. And you're going to roll up to the stop sign and make a complete stop, then make a right turn. So the examiners are going to be outside talking to you on the phone. They're going to tell you to make a right turn. So as soon as they say make a right turn or a left turn or anything, make sure you signal. If you don't signal, you're going to lose four points. So it's four mm -hmm. negative points, right? So we're going to make a right turn here. So go up. And you make a right, and then you're going to make an immediate right. You're going to make a right turn as soon as you finish this right. So you straighten the wheel here, straighten the wheel. And you make sure your mirror is past the curb before you turn. Turn all the way right. Because if you turn before your mirror is past the curb, you will hit the curb with the back wheel. Alright, so now we're going to go all the way down to the end of this road here. All the way down and then we're gonna make a right turn speed limit here is between 10 and 15 so don't go too fast all right we're gonna stop at the end here and we're gonna make a right turn so you stop completely one two three go ahead and make your right turn again make sure your mirror is past the curb make it tight straighten the wheel make sure your mirror past the curb again and make a right and again, make sure you're signaling every time. All right, go straight down here. They're going to tell you to come down here, and then they're going to tell you to stop. Probably about here. 
then they're gonna tell you basically they want you to speed up to 20 and do a sudden stop all right so go ahead hit the gas speed up 20 miles per hour and stop okay that's good now they're gonna ask you to reverse in a straight line so you look behind you and you go straight back they're gonna tell you to go straight back until they tell you to stop so about here they're gonna say stop now you're gonna go forward and you're gonna park in between those cones they'll have four cones down there right now I have two cones I'm not gonna show you but you can see it right so stay closer to your right side and then you're gonna park in between the cones signal left make sure you don't go that far over here though look you see right now you're practically in okay. the space so you don't want to be in the space but go up just a touch more right there no gas here man no gas turn all the way left and roll into the space just remember you don't need any any gas right here just mm -hmm. let go of the brakes and let it roll slow is good you know what I mean you want to do it nice mm -hmm. and slow and as perfectly as possible so you go into the middle and straighten the wheel and straighten the wheel right there and stop no no you're good right there straight so that's good now once you're here you're gonna be asked to reverse out of the space all right put the car in reverse and you're gonna reverse until your mirror is past the pole you see the pole so you're gonna go straight back when your mirror here is past the curb then you're going to Turn all the way to the left. All right, all the way left. Look behind. And you're going to stop here. Now we're going to go put the car back in drive. All the way to the right. And we're going to go down to that stop sign right there. And we're going to make a left turn. So you make sure you signal left. Again, remember to signal every single time. You understand? So you stop completely. One, two, three. You signal in left, so you turn in left. You're going to pull up next to the line right here. And then they're going to tell you to make to do the three-point turn and you guys if you hear all that noise is from the lawnmowers they're cutting the grass so you have a uh, like three driving lawnmower going at the same time all right go ahead and make your three-point turn and stop here put the car back in reverse all the way to the right behind you and reverse set down the gas all right go ahead and make a right turn and make the right here Now that's the entire test. What do you think? It was decent, man. You know, <laughs> it's decent. It's all about the reps, man. Yeah. It's so we're gonna we're reps. gonna continue practicing. We're gonna practice in the morning again. Mm -hmm. So for sure you're gonna pass the test. Like I can tell already that you're gonna pass. So as you see, you know, again we do this with every student. Every every student that that gets an appointment at a DMV, I'll take them to practice and. The results are always positive, right? Mm -hmm. So that's it. So again, I want you to like this video, share the video, 
subscribe to the channel, man. I need people to subscribe and share it to your friends. Tell your friends about the channel. So this is real knowledge right here, man. That's what's up. Real knowledge right here. Yeah, so help me share the channel. Help me to build it. I am at, what, 3,000, almost 300 subscribers. I need five and 10,000 and forward, you know what I mean? So help me to get to those numbers, all right? Anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next video.